Welcome to Photoshop Art. I'm going to show you how to make this moon reflection. Before we start, download this document from my Google Drive so you can follow. Link is in the video description. Enable the shape layer. Select the moon layer. Press Ctrl J on your keyboard to make a copy. Name it Reflection. Select the moon layer and enable it. Enable Transform Controls. Make the moon the same size as the shape. Align the middle of the moon with the shape. Click OK. Use arrow keys to reposition the moon. I'm going to press Ctrl T and make it a bit smaller. Select the rectangular marquee tool and select upper half of the moon. Click on the mask icon. Select the reflection layer and enable it. Make the moon little bigger than the shape. Confirm that. Control click on the shape thumbnail to make its selection. Click on the mask icon. Select the shape layer and delete it by clicking delete button on the keyboard. Change the blend mode to overlay. Go to FX and select outer glow. For opacity type 10. Noise 0. Spread 0. Size 10. Range 55. Jitter 40. Click OK. Go to Filter. Blur. Gaussian Blur. Blur it about 6 pixels. We going to blur the edges later. Select the moon layer. Go to outer glow again. Change opacity to 50 and size to 100. Make a new layer. Right-click on the layer and create a clipping mask. Press D for default colors. Press X to select the white color. Press B to select the brush. 
Right click on the image and double click on the soft round brush to select it. Use bracket keys to make the brush about this size. Hold shift and make a line on the moon bottom. Lower the opacity to 50%. Select the reflection. Shift click on the moon layer to select all three layers. Press Ctrl G to group those layers. Go to Adjustments and select Levels. Click on the clipping icon to clip it to the moon group. Make some room if you don't see the properties. In the middle field type 3.5. In the right field type 100. Expand the moon group and select the reflection mask. Go to Filter. Blur. Gaussian Blur. Just click OK. Press V for Move Tool. If you see this gap use arrow keys to move the reflection up. Select the water layer. Use the selection tool to select just the water. Click on the mask icon. Make a new layer while holding control, to make a new layer below the water. Press B for brush. Make it little bigger using bracket keys. Hold shift and make a line on the horizon. Lower its opacity to 20%. Select the space layer. Press V for move tool. Make sure transform is enabled. Press Ctrl-0. Reposition the space to whatever you like. Click OK. Disable Transform Controls. Press Ctrl-0. I made some planets for you. Enable and expand the planets group. Enable transform controls. Now select one planet at time and place it on the sky.
There is one more thing to do to make it more realistic. Enable the space layer. Use the selection tool to select the sky. Press Ctrl J to make a copy. Press V for Move tool. Enable Transform Controls. Hold the Shift button and drag the top of the sky to the bottom. Click OK. Drag the layer above the water layer. Change the blend mode to color dodge. Lower opacity to 50%. Go to filter. Blur. Gaussian blur. Blur it about 50 pixels. You can see why we done this. This is Photoshop art. Thank you for watching this video.